Hey guys, welcome back to Chat with Ade on Adeba CTV. Welcome again, your host Ade Tiladende. Yes, welcome back to um, the interview with I and Mr. Andrew Enofe. Thanks for coming back for part two. Enjoy. We think about when we want to do things, not just think about ourselves and be selfish, but to think of the generations and the legacy that we want to leave behind. Now, you you spoke on something. I would like you to elaborate a little bit more. So, yes. forget it. Mm -hmm. You see, you want to wonder, you should understand if you pass on, why are they crying? Mm -hmm. Are they crying for your actual loss or they are crying for the debt yeah, you put them into? You get what I'm saying? Because, see, I was discussing with a friend um, some time ago. He said, oh, he doesn't want to become an, um, um, what do you call it? He doesn't want, uh, he says his uncle is very rich, mm -hmm. but if he dies, he doesn't want him to have part of his inheritance. I said, why? He said, you don't understand. If he puts you as to have part of his inheritance, mm -hmm. you also have him part of his debt. Mm. So if they are crying, are they crying because they really miss you? Mm. I said they cry because, <laughs> or are they crying? Intensi intensify intensively because of the depths you have put them oh, into, mm. right? Oh, now they have to discuss about funeral costs. Yes, they have to discuss about paying debts mm. and whatnot. What arrangement have you put in place, Oof. right? Yes, as you earlier said, you see a lot of gold fund me. Mm -hmm. Like you see a lot of people raising stuff for when people passed on. Why do you want to put extra body on your family? Yeah, you get what I'm saying. Yeah. Why can't you avoid Going to Timothy's, mm -hmm. take a dollar per day, buy insurance, yes. $200,000, one fifty, mm -hmm. right? If you can buy a home, you can buy an insurance. Definitely. Right? So you know your family will smile. Like mm. their tears is not double tears, no, right? <laughs> they will know, okay, the funeral is taken care yeah. of. Yeah. Not, oh, now it's gone. How mm -hmm. do we pay the children's school fees? Yeah, how, school do we pay fees? For, yeah. how do we pay for the funeral costs? How do we pay for the... We have to have some um um uh we have to have uh um take care of ourselves yes and take care of our loved ones yes. when we're gone yes right let's, let's let's do that let's do that we can't keep blaming the the system the, the society system. we can't you get what i'm saying we can there's loopholes there's avenues that has been created and people like mr andrew have tapped into it so we need to connect with him so we can also tap into those resources that are available to us so you mm -hmm. see what why they call some people are privileged they're not privileged mm. you see if you look at canadian right look at proper canadian for example the canadian contest yes they don't have a lot of money no they don't right but they're very smart mm -hmm. i'm not an insurance agent though <laughs> but you see they have insurance yes when they pass on mm -hmm. their kids are guaranteed two hundred thousand two hundred thousand mm -hmm. if you have a two hundred thousand startup yes right you won't be where you are today no it's like us, we came mm -hmm. without nothing. We have to struggle and build everything we everything. have today yes. with pure tears and blood and mm -hmm. sweat and whatnot. Yeah. But if I had, had $200,000 from uh, my parents, right? At least I will have more homes now, for mm -hmm. example. Yes. Right? It will put you in a better, advantageous that's, situation that's than starting to start from yes. the, uh, the bottom and start struggling. Struggling. Up, right? Mm -hmm. So if you don't have real estate, you can buy insurance. Yes. Right? Start from there start from there it it it's that's the wisdom that you know our parents or first generation um canadians did not have they didn't have that information you know so now you guys you have that information use it to your advantage use it to your advantage other races other cultures they're using it don't be left behind you guys we're too smart for this let's wake up and start doing things the way we should we need to tap into the system in order to get ahead and not be left behind so let's do it link up with mr andrew if you need be any other real estate or insurance um providers around you that you know and of course we, we have a lot in our table so connect with us <laughs> you know, we'll, give, we'll give you the right set of people and you know at the end of the day you want to do what you have you want to have that head and it's not even so much of a head if everybody around you is doing it. You're just being smart. Of course. That's just it. You're just keen to the society and the system belonging, right? So you're just, you're not taking advantage you're of not. the situation. You're just, you're just tapping into it. It works for others, 
Like, yeah. for example, I started with one property, mm -hmm. right? And after one property, I refinanced that first property. Mm -hmm. I bought the second property. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Yes. We refinance the second one. We bought the third one. Mm -hmm. But if you haven't started, you, what are you going to refinance? Nothing. You get what I'm saying? What are you going to take equity out from? Nothing. Right? You have to overcome the fear. Mm -hmm. You have to overcome. You know, we Nigerians or black don't like to talk about life after <laughs> okay. death. We think we're going to live forever. We don't yeah. plan for the future. Yeah. You know, mm -hmm. we believe in God, mm. oh, don't talk about when you're talking about this, you are scared. It's gonna happen. I met someone in 35 years. He said, Andrew, I bought my grave already. I said, Wow, wow, wow. that was <laughs> <a serious answer. laughs> like he said, I bought it already. He said, When he's dead, mm -hmm. nobody is gonna suffer. Mm. Just you get what I'm saying? Yeah. But we can think beyond that, right? Mm. We can think about our children. Yes. Look, let's think about it. For example, you can't walk no more, yeah, or the person can't walk no more mm -hmm. due to one illness or the other one. Mm -hmm. Most people don't have insurance, yeah. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Your body is your vehicle. Mm -hmm. Your work will pay you up to certain amounts and they'll stop. That's it. Yeah, will stop. And the other people will stop. So what is your plan? Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Yes. What's your plan? What's your exit plan? Mm -hmm. I tell people I'm into real estate. Mm -hmm. Um, I don't have ear. Mm -hmm. I don't have any of those stuff. Yes. Then I have to know that every single dollar I get, mm -hmm. I must not spend it. Yes. I must invest my money. money. Mm -hmm. Because those are my pension. Mm -hmm. Those are my retirement funds. Mm -hmm. You hear what I'm saying? Yes. I want to be able to still take my kids to school, any school that they of their choice. Mm -hmm. Not trying to overcrowd the system. You hear yes. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You have to leave a legacy. Mm -hmm. right? You might say, oh, it's easier for him now because he's there. <laughs> I didn't get there just because I wanted to get there. Mm -hmm. We work hard. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. You are determined. Mm -hmm. When you buy your first home, it's not easy. You have mm -hmm. to cry yeah. because you have to scrape all money from everywhere. Mm -hmm. But after you pay one, two, three, four, five months for a private home owner, mm -hmm. the market comes good. You <laughs> refinance. You get what I'm saying? You mm -hmm. just start building mm -hmm. up, right? You cannot just wait in, oh, I'm about disadvantage mm -hmm. because I'm um, of a minority mm -hmm. and nothing is working. Things are working, right? Are working. But you have to put yourself in the position. Yeah. And most important thing, mm -hmm. you have to align with people that know the system. Yes. You get what I'm saying? That's the... It's not just every other person that knows no. the system. No, it's not. I wanted to hire an accountant once, mm -hmm. a very expensive accountant. So I asked him some few questions. I said, Do you have a property? Because he's going to manage some of my portfolio. He yeah. said, No. I didn't hire him. Hmm. Recently, I didn't hire him. I don't want someone that knows theory. <laughs> right? I want to also know some practical, practical. part of it. Yeah. He has his reasons mm -hmm. that he didn't have his own stuff. Mm -hmm. What I'm saying is that if you want to deal with a real estate agent on yeah. investment, you have to deal with somebody that That's has also an investment, yes. that has an experience, that yeah. knows what he or she is doing. Yeah. Right? It's not better. just to pick up a rookie. Mm -hmm. well, rookies are good, depends mm -hmm. on your level, right? Yeah. But you have to pick someone that has some years of experience, someone that have done it, mm -hmm. have been there, that can direct you mm -hmm. rightly on what to do, yes. and then you'll be happy at the end. Mm. Think about that. <laughs> so, uh -huh. the, the mistakes some people make coming in when they just newly arrive in in Canada, you know, of course, like you mentioned earlier, depending on who you know, some people say, "Oh, you know, Canada is hard." Canada, you have to struggle. You have to do three jobs. You have to do four jobs. Or, you know, you have to start at a warehouse before you can even think of buying home. Maybe you've worked like five, six years. You know, all this negative, negative. And we know maybe before that's how it was. But at this moment, that's, not, that's no longer the situation. That's no longer the story. So please, let's give them a breakdown on and break some of those, um, what do you call it? Um, um, barriers or negative yeah um, barriers and uh, I know there's a word I'm looking stigma? for stigmas that you know a lot of people have been telling and retelling let's break it down because now things have changed it has really really changed okay you see oh, someone once said um, if you are in the midst of 10 9 million 10 million years mm -hmm. you'll be the 11th mm. Right? Yeah. And if you're in the midst of 10 broke people, mm -hmm. <laughs> you'll be the 11th. Right? Mm. See, we were in a series of meetings yesterday uh, with some of our partners. Mm -hmm. And we met some investors with having a discussion. They told us their experience, right? Mm -hmm. And I told them that 
just because it didn't work for you this way doesn't yeah. really mean it's not going to work for me. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. um, you, have to, you have to be in a place where people are, people are thinking positively. Are you a first-time home buyer and considering purchasing your first home? A common challenge for many Canadian home buyers is coming up with the money to make a down payment. The best way to help make the dream of home ownership a reality is by using RRSP and FHSA as down payment and taking advantage of high interest rates. Join us for a webinar, January 27, 2023, at 8 p.m. via Zoom. The host Andrew Inofi and guest speaker Michael Wuerl, moderated by Rita Ferraz, will be walking you through the process of using RRSP and FHSA that allows you to finance your properties in a cost-effective way and the advantage of the interest. Contact us at 905-226-3600 or 416-833-8909. Visit our website, www.andrewanofi.com. thinking positively, mm. right? Mm -hmm. When I came to Canada, I saw a lot of people um, walking, doing different kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. I have to make the choice what to do. Mm -hmm. Do I want to make money now or do I want to invest in myself, mm. in my career, in my future? Yes. Right? Yeah. So that I can have a better lifestyle in the future. Mm -hmm. Or do I just want to quickly make money, yes. send money home, build? Then when you are ready, now you have created unnecessary pressure for yourself. Mm -hmm. Expectations, yes, right? Yes. People are always expecting ah. the person you give $50 every month. Mm -hmm. You cannot tell the person you want to go back to school. Mm -mm. say for what? what? <laughs> you're doing well, right? But you're doing well for them. Yes. Not for you. Not for you. So you have to invest in yourself first, yes. right? You have to have the proper structure in place. Mm -hmm. See, people will not die, right? Mm -mm. They if they are not sick, Mm -hmm. Right, they are not admitted in the hospital or yeah. whatnot. But if they are living, they just need the money, mm -hmm. everybody can work. Yes, like I tell my folks back home that you don't need money to start a business, mm -mm. but everybody just thinks I need one million dollars <laughs> and naira, I need two million. You don't, you just have to have the idea and build your business gradually. Gradually, yeah. don't just think to start from the top. Mm -hmm. Nobody started from the top. If yeah. I give you money to start a business from the top, the business is guaranteed going to crash. Gonna crash. Yeah, so. Mm -hmm. Those newcomers in Canada, the most important thing is your credit, mm. right? Mm. You have to build your credit. Mm. You see, someone that have five hundred thousand mm -hmm. dollars with a with 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 a bad credit, mm -hmm. and someone that have no money with a good credit, mm. the bank will take the one that have no money with a good credit okay. before five hundred thousand, right? So you have to build your credit, mm. right? As I said, everyone has money. Mm. Believe me, <laughs> right? Believe me. See. We work mm -hmm. or we all do something, mm -hmm. right? I spend less than 20% of my income mm. on myself, mm. right? I reinvest my money. Mm. I, you have to discipline yourself yeah. to the position that, you know what? It's not, oh, my paycheck this week, boom, spend it, spend mm. it. You keep spending it. I realized there was a time I was living on $500 a month. Mm -hmm. It was more than enough. It was sufficient. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? So you have to sew your code according to your material. Mm -hmm. So if you're working, you're making $3,000, mm -hmm. you can save 20%. Mm -hmm. You can cut down the cost. You don't have to buy Timotins every morning. <laughs> you, or else you're a shareholder of Timotins, right? Mm -hmm. You don't have to. You can buy a tea bag mm -hmm. and make tea from home. Make breakfast you from home. You don't have the in the store. You buy it. You make it every day in the house. You hey. understand? So you can make breakfast from home. You yeah. can make lunch. These things are cheaper. Yes. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You put money together little by little. You discipline yourself. Yeah. Right? You will be able to do it. Mm. But you see, people are looking for the finished products. Mm. Right? They don't want to go through the process. Mm. Right? They don't want to start from where they are right now. Yes and get themselves to where they want to go to. Mm. Probably those that have been able to navigate through it, before they get there, they screw up their credit. Mm. You get what I'm yeah. saying? So, your circle is very important. Thanks. Circle is very important, mm -hmm. right? The people you communicate with. Mm -hmm. And some of the, sometimes there are also people mm -hmm. that have failed before, yeah. and you want to tell them you want to succeed, mm -hmm. then they'll say, oh, no, 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 it's not possible. <laughs> I tell people, because it's not possible. Someone once said, yeah. It's one said, because um, it's not possible with you, mm -hmm. doesn't mean it's not possible. Yes. Right? Yes. If I come to this mindset, oh, you cannot buy a house. Mm -hmm. 
According to his knowledge, mm -hmm. it simply means that is all he knows. Yes. So it's not possible with him. Doesn't mean it's not possible. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's based on their knowledge or what they know. Mm -hmm. So if they say, "Oh, don't buy a house here. There are many expenses to be paid in the house." Mm -hmm. Blah blah blah. We bought a house 1954. We weren't able to pay the mortgage. Yet. That is based on what you know, mm. right? There's yeah. a better way to do it now, do it now. right? Yeah. Or that is based on the people you wear with mm. that taught you what you knew. Yes. Probably might be wrong. Yes. So there are other options, mm. right? There yeah. are other ways to get stuff going. Yeah. So what I understand, you immigrant, is possible. Like, really, really possible, possible, right? You just have to connect with the right team mm -hmm. and follow the instructions, mm. right? You're making two thousand dollars a month. Mm -hmm. Don't go live in a condominium for mm -hmm. one thousand eight hundred a month. Yeah, right. Get a room in a house. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Pay six hundred dollars. Mm. You know what you are doing? You are you are you are investing for your future, mm. right? Mm -hmm. You have a five bedroom house, for example. Yes. You're only going to sleep in one room. Mm -hmm. Not if what happened mm -hmm. to the rest for collecting dust. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> Get it when you get it, mm -hmm. stay in one room, pay 600 instead of 2000 or 1800. Mm. Save the rest money mm. before you know a year you have 20,000. Mm. The second year you have another 20,000, 40,000. You put it in a good investment, probably at the end of the third year, you'll be ready to buy a house, mm. right? If you have no other needs, mm -hmm. no other income that coming, you can do it. It's possible, you know, it's possible. Nice. It's possible. Yeah. I remember before, like years ago, people were like, oh, it takes you like 20 years, 25 years to pay off a home, this and that. And of course, we had that notion for years. But now we hear like people are paying off homes in like within two years, within three years. It's like, how are you doing it? <laughs> I don't even want to pay off my home, though. I don't want to pay off my home. Mm -hmm. I don't want to pay off my investment property. <laughs> I want to keep taking money from the property. <laughs> and buy, mm. I sell my property, you make a million dollars. What are you going to do with a million dollars? Mm. You spend it, that's the end of the money. Mm. But you buy another property. Yes. Now, see, now a million dollars, you spend it, you spend your capital. Mm. But you can invest that million dollars in another property okay. and make $2,000 every month, for example. Mm. That $2,000 is residual income for the rest of your life. Mm. Right? Yeah. So why would I want to spend, spend my capital mm -hmm. and eat my tomorrow today? It's not possible. Mm. You, get what I'm you have yes. to have discipline. You yeah. get what I'm saying? Money on its own will not make you rich. No. But you have to make the money work, work for, for you, you in order for you to be rich. Mm. Yes, guys. My pastor always says it. He says it's not your nine to five job that's going to make you rich. That's just going to pay your bills. But it's what you're doing after nine to five. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> that's what's going to make you wealthy. So, hey, you can still do your nine to five, but what are you doing after nine to five? You know? Let's you can invest. do sides also. Yes. Let's you hustle, 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 hustle. Save up the funds. Invest. And make that money do what? Work for you. And I'll let us tell you, 99% of people that are, are that rich became rich through real estate. Hmm. There's no that. Well, I have not seen any other thing you can do to make the kind of money you make in real estate. Hmm. Let's just backtrack to the last two years. Hmm. People I saw the house to yeah. in February, mm -hmm. before 2021 ending, mm -hmm. I saw the house for 800. Hmm. You've made another $800,000. Right? Yes, it's stupid market. The market was crazy. But people gained from the market. Yes. People made money. Like like money from the market. Okay. Let's assume you are not even making money. Mm -hmm. You're paying down your principal. You're mm -hmm. building up your equity. The mm -hmm. cash price goes up. Right? With property, it's win-win. Mm. Right? You guys. It's win-win. The right guy right here with the right information. So you do what? You need to give him a call. Check him out. Which, which social media handle are you very active in? Which one? Uh, mm. <laughs> some people are active on Instagram, some people on Facebook, some people are active on their WhatsApp. I think we are know? pretty on all social media. I think uh, Instagram. 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 Okay. We're on Instagram. Uh, sorry, I don't control this thing myself. So. <laughs> <laughs> so the number he gave you, that number, personal number, you can call on that number. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But we're on Instagram. Mm -hmm. right? We're on Instagram. It's Andrew Enough. You understand? Andrew underscore in office. Okay, okay. Um, uh, Facebook, we are on Facebook. Mm -hmm. We are on, uh, what's it called? TikTok. TikTok. And, uh, and um, which other one? They, they what do you have? call it? LinkedIn. Yeah, yeah LinkedIn. we are on LinkedIn. We're, we're working on our social media platform mm -hmm. currently. But we are on Instagram. Right? We are on Instagram. Right. So Instagram, check them out.
call, get his private, get his WhatsApp so you can just, you know, boom, 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 ask questions, get the answers right there and then. And do what? Tap into the resources, into the, the wealth of knowledge. The wealth of knowledge that we didn't have this information like 10 years ago, 15, 20 years ago. We didn't have this. If we had someone in the community that has such information, we would have tapped into it. But now we do. And we're letting you guys know that are coming in that you don't listen to the fables of Yes, they were telling the truth. It takes years to build. To no, do, but no, 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 they now. were telling the truth. They know at yes, that time. Yes, they were telling. It's true. Because <laughs> we didn't know the information that we know now. So the information has always been there. But the, we did not know it. So now that we know it, let's take advantage of it. Let's use it for our own um, betterment. And let's not just, okay, you know what? You already have a home. You're good. You're, you're, you're investing. You're fine. Guess what? There might be somebody else that you know that needs this information. So do what? Click the share button, pass it on to them, tell them they should do what? Listen to this, not just also watch this, but guess what? Take the number down, give them his, um, Mr. Andrew's number, tell them to give him a call. They might not even have to start right away, but they can communicate, they can talk, they can consult so that they know that, okay, maybe in the next six months, in the next year or in the next two years, okay, we're going to have this amount and we'll start building our portfolio. So it doesn't even have to be right away, but let them just have that it's knowledge. Possible. It, it's possible. It is possible. So you know what? Let them have the knowledge and see what they're willing to do for themselves to make that change and to get to that dream because Canada is yours to discover. So you've got to discover it yourself. So for you to get to that dream that you want to, you know, you want to get to, you want to build not just for yourself, but for your children. And you don't have to just build a dream and say, oh, it's my children that we enjoy it. No, you can build a dream where you yourself, you're going to enjoy and leave for your children to continue. And let's do that by doing what? Sharing this information. Information is very what? It's key. It's, it's key. It's key. Hey, it, it's important. Information. The right information is no joke. Oh. It can get someone that is that just came in, doing well within two, three years, and someone that has been here in five years and they're not even on the same plate, or 10 years and they're not on the same plate because of the information that person got when they got in. And you don't even have to wait till you come into the country. If you know you're already planning to come to the country, you know that, okay, well, next year, I already have my visa. I'm coming to Canada. Guess what? Tap into this information. Get his number. Start communicating now. Don't wait till you even arrive. Start communicating. What can you do now? So that you can, when you get here, you can, start, you can start right away. You understand? So don't wait till you're even in the country. Before you get into the country, but well, definitely, this is our man, Mr. Andrew Nofe. We're definitely banking him under our Adiba connector connectors. <laughs> so definitely, um, we will be linking up with him even more and having more seminars. Like it says, we're going to be pushing out a lot of his seminars just so that we can always do what encourage and enlighten our followers. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. So, just um, a quick to add to it. Mm -hmm. I was with some investors yesterday. Mm -hmm. It amazes me to know that it's, it asks me if I have any doctor friend mm -hmm. that is in Canada that they can actually give a doctor 100% finance. 100% finance. Wow. But if we don't have the information, hey. how will you know? He said they need a doctor or a dentist. Wow. Right? Mm -hmm. That they have a project that they can give 100%. You come in with zero. Wow. You get what I'm saying? We have doctors. In information is power. It's very right. You have to connect with the right yeah. at their back connect to connect you with the right resources. <laughs> Mr. Andrew and okay. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? Yes. So these are very important. Mm -hmm. These are what we need in the community, right? Yes. In order for us to build up our community, we have to we be together to. and stay we strong and change information within yes. ourselves. That's right? why we're here. That's why we're here because listen we're not like, we're not back home where everybody's on their own doing whatever they can the competition is not like that here you guys we need to strive not as individuals because we know ourselves as africans we're very good we are we can we succeed anywhere we go that's true it's 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 even they know it <laughs> statistics knows it but that's not the issue here the thing is you need to come as a collective when you come as a collective it's it's, it's, it's there is you are gaining grounds you're able to gain ground you can you can stand make as a decision. community you make decisions Talk. they will listen to they you they will listen the government will listen they have no choice the politicians will listen 
because you 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 have numbers they're scared of that that is what they will listen to is numbers so you can't say oh i made this i made that you can be a millionaire and be on your own that's Absolutely. not going to make it it's not going to affect anybody to change anybody to do nothing what impact are you doing for the rest of people okay now, now okay you're successful i'm successful mm -hmm. right we can sit with the other elites yes so what position does that put you in life right why don't you have like 10 other people mm -hmm. that can sit with you on that table, table. Right? Yes. That you have said, okay, you know what? I've raised these 10 other people. Mm -hmm. They are sitting with me on this table. Yes. Or I've educated these other 20 people. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm a homeowner, for example, yes. in uh, Toronto. Mm -hmm. Why would I want to be just the only black homeowner in Toronto? Toronto. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. We go to board meeting, for example. I only have one vote, one voice. But when we are 5,000, mm -hmm. we go there, hmm. they will seek for our opinion. Yes. Right? Our opinion becomes what they will use to make a decision right but if we just one of your okay 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 at least we have admitted one right <laughs> they can't deny they can't say we didn't listen what my pastor said he said they um um he applied for a company in the, uh to work with a company they apply him mm -hmm. because they wanted to have uh, a diversity right yes for racial they have to meet that yeah. quota mm -hmm. he said he was the black man he's really black <laughs> right he said they have to put him there so that they will know that this is a really black <laughs> We don't need that kind of... Hello guys, it's your girl Betty and welcome back to another episode of the Adeba Advert Splash Show. Today, we bring to you Bola Healthcare Services. Bola Healthcare Services has a wide range of specialized healthcare professionals with own care experience. They also provide assistance and company by keeping you involved and engaged by planning activities that enhances your well-being. They also help their daily living activities such as bathing, toileting, feeding, mobility, dressing, and many more. Do you want to learn more? She can contact one of our care experts on this number that is being displayed on your screen, or she can log into our website at www.bolahealthcare.com. We don't need that kind of. No. We don't need that. We don't need that kind of uh, acceptance. No, we don't. Right? We want to go there with our heads high because mm -hmm. we know what we're doing. We yes. know what we're saying. We have the uh, uh, uh what's it called? We have the uh, pre qualifications. Yes. We have what it takes. Mm -hmm. Not just putting people there, building people to build generational wealth. What we're talking, we're talking. Yes. Like okay, no, just we are noise. part of the system. Mm -hmm. We know what is happening. Yes. Right. Not. When they are looking for a ratio is 1.111 percent right that? they can do it we can do it mm -hmm. right yes. we just have to connect with ourselves we have to work together we got to work together working together opens doors it opens so much doors like the past was it last year or so a lot of people i saw a lot of africans in going into politics and i'm like wow the representative alone is so overwhelming it's so nice because growing up you don't see black people and any black people you see maybe they are from haiti or jamaica and that's it so now when you're seeing like africans coming out and and standing in positions and oh my gosh you're like you know and it is not just for you but the, you're being a representative for the generations to see that hey i can also be a politician or i can also run for this counselor or you know anything prime minister eventually you know it's open they're not just seeing only white people indians chinese no they're also seeing their skin Inclusive. color and it goes a long way we have no idea the little steps that we're taking even if you don't get the vote in but guess what just the fact that you were there you stood out oh my god you don't know how many lives you touched and inspired that now the next time we're, we're going out to vote you're not going to see just one or two you're going to see a lot of people because we're like guess what we can do it we can do it there's nothing impossible there's no doors that we cannot open we can do but we got to do what collectively we got to do it together so you guys please this is not for us alone this information is for you guys out there and for the ones that you're going to send it to they're also going to watch and be impacted that we need to work together to be able to have a we need to have a strong front to be able to open those doors and impact not just this generation but the generations to come the other day i was looking uh for a black owned media right yes do you know they are 
really, really little to non brand new media. Yeah. No, no, right? no. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you, yeah. it was so surprising. I know mm -hmm. there are other um, media, like, if you look at the main media, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. They are not, not even <laughs> black, like, no, none of the minority on. Yes. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Yes, there are barriers. There yes. are barriers. But if I'm not doing my little thing in my little corner, yes. and you're not doing your little things in your little corner, we come as 50, mm -hmm. we'll say, you know what? We're going to spare this cost. Yes. They will be forced. Mm -hmm. They have no other option. At all. Right? Yeah. You come in 50, mm -hmm. it's better that you come in in one. Yes. Right? Yes. They'll say, okay, you know what? There's no space now, but we'll make it happen. They will make it because they know the audience is there. They will make it. So let's work together as a community, Please. as a team. You know, yes, there may also be challenges. Every community has their own uh, Everybody, not just us. Right? Everybody if I does. work with a different community mm -hmm. and they did me wrong, yeah. I can't go to their community <laughs> and report them. Just because if we work within our community and yes. there's issues, mm -hmm. we can come within our community. So they also have issues in their community. They do. Oh, yeah, they, right? do. they do. But they will not come and tell you. No. Right? I tell my friend, I tell my friends or clients sometimes, I say, see, right? I've never represented an Indian. Mm. person before mm. right yeah i've never represented chinese uh, clients mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. they stick with themselves with yes. their race i've never represented jewish mm -hmm. they will never come to you mm -mm. be you the best mm -hmm. <laughs> i don't care they want the money to stay within their community if you don't use me as an agent there are a lot of black agents yeah. we amaze you to know an average real estate agent sell one house in a year Hmm. Right, one property in a year. Wow. Right. So there are a lot of agents within mm -hmm. our community mm -hmm. that needs your help. Yes. That needs you. Yes. So why will you leave the community to suffer and take your money elsewhere? Where those communities are not bringing their money into our community, community, right? You're doing a disjustice and a disarm to yourself. Then you have a business. Nobody supports your business. Yeah. Then you feel bad. Mm -hmm. No. The Bible says, "Whatsoever you sow, you reap." Really? You get what I'm saying? Yeah. You don't have to come to me, no. right? But there are the good real estate agents yes. in our community. Yeah. Then you can you say, you know what? To. Let me build up the community. Yes. This community building up. Let me build up our community. Let the money stay within our community. Yeah. So that when there is a fundraising, mm -hmm. they're looking for five thousand or fifty thousand mm -hmm. dollars. You know there are ten agents in the community that can give the money. money. Yes. Right? Don't let projects die because mm -hmm. there's no funding. Yes. We can do it. Yes. Right? Let's build our community. Please. It is needed. Thank you so much. Thank you for Excellent. your time. No Thank problem. you for your time. Thank you so much and for we'll, having me. We'll be visiting you more often. No problem. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> All right, guys. So, you guys, don't forget to click the share button, a like button, comment below, and uh, follow his handles. It will be there in the, in, the, in the buttons down there. You're going to see his information again. Do not forget to give them a call, to check them out, to say hello, to follow them on social media, Facebook and Instagram. And to think about what we've just said. Don't just keep this information to yourself. Share it out to others. It does not even cost you a dime to share, it doesn't. So do that, at least you can do that. Thank you. Bye. <laughs>